right uh, what's up guys i'm back again with another video and today uh, i want to share with you this super awesome i think you have already seen it uh, but it's gonna be i'm gonna be sharing about ncmpcpp with web result today if you don't know what ncmpcpp is ncmpcpp is a terminal music player uh, it uses the music player daemon of or mpd so the one that plays the music is mpd and the one that's uh, the one for interface and using stuff is mp uh, ncmpcpp for choosing uh, song and stuff and then uh, for the for the image reviewer r or what is it called uh, album art then it's gonna be using uh, uh, web result there i'm gonna uh, let's play this one real quick ah. yeah this one actually uh error uh, i don't know why but if it's error it's gonna be showing this one uh, i i don't know why it got error i think it's because of the zip file uh, got i don't know got corrupted or something i don't know i literally don't know bro. but yeah it's gonna show album image here in your right side well depend on how you put the config in so uh, how do you do this i'm gonna show it to you here in this video that's why i'm doing this right obviously and then uh, what what else am i going to do crazy all right uh, uh you just go to github.com slice tam hyphen kare i don't know how you pronounce it but uh here ncmpcpp web result and then uh, you scroll down uh, he actually has this setup guide pretty easy to follow uh, if you don't know how to follow it well I'm, I can uh, show it to you as well. Uh, if you have PIP3, yeah, install WebResult web result using it. Uh, if you run Arch-based uh, system, uh, then just use pacman sudo pacman even s uh, WebResult. Yeah, just do this. Uh, install WebResult if maybe uh, it doesn't got installed uh sing your repository first uh lots of beginner forget to sing their repository and then saying pacman got stuck and something uh, uh bro is sing the repository and then uh, if you want to update your system as well uh, syu but yeah uh, whatever install web result first right and then after that you go to this uh, go to your config file your ncmpcpp config now uh, as you might have already know uh, uh, you don't have dot ncmpcpp here at least if you're using looksmith's setup because it's located in dot uh, config ncmpcpp right so this is your config file and not dot ncmpcpp because this is how it's supposed to be right so your home screen doesn't get cluttered it's not mess uh yeah just do this and then after that uh you have to clone the repository and cmpcpp web result i have already cloned it here you might see and then in i'm sorry and then the, in here in this ncmpcpp web result you will map this to a shell command make, make sure you ch mod uh, this two so ch mod uh, plus x ncmpcpp cover art and ncmpcpp web result uh, once that is done uh, you can go on to the config uh, the configuring of this thing of, of web result first in in here 
you in the ancient pcpp config uh, you need to add this line these three lines uh, execute on some changes and then to ancient pcpp cover r.sh file there and then the other two is this one uh, it's this one playlist display mode columns uh, if you use the columns one because i am using the columns one so i uh, just uh, i uncomment this line uh, wait i commented that, that one and i just put it here so that uh, it seems like <laughs> the tutorial right it seems like uh, i follow the tutorial perfectly or whatever and you, you don't have to configure anything in this one just follow this one just copy it paste it and it's done yeah, you don't need to touch anything again there and then to configure the rest of the thing you need to uh, edit this one cmpp pp uh, cover art and in here uh, make sure that the music library is correct the folder and then the fallback image is uh, going to the right uh, file and then this uh, tree is gonna be our main uh, configuration so if you see here <clears throat> uh, actually there is also one here let's uh, explain padding top gonna be top as you might have been expected adding right it's gonna be in this right bottom is gonna be in bottom but yeah uh, as you might have seen in my uh, setup here this is uh, the padding one uh, the padding bottom is one the padding right is also one and this one is uh, 15 so uh, let's see w what it looks like right on 20 yes just so that you guys can see what it looks like uh, it's gonna look something like this there you go it's a bit uh oh yeah i forgot to say as well i use the four square so it's gonna be always square is the hair if i don't use this right if, if i just use uh false uh, it's gonna well i don't know what it would look like here but let's see well it's gonna look the same and this one but uh, if the, your padding is something like a three right uh, it's gonna look really weird uh, i'll show it to you because this is wait what wait what uh wait a second nah uh, well I, I don't know what happened but I, I think it's because it's catched or something but basically uh, uh what I was trying to uh, show you is that uh if you don't do the first square it's gonna uh sometimes uh it's gonna crop out this one the it's gonna get cropped out and then it just doesn't look that great so yeah i just turn on the four square uh, for that and then uh what else is there that you need to add this is this is what you need to add or change at least uh, the reserve calls in percent change that to true and then uh, this one is our playlist calls uh, it's gonna be 75 well uh, it's gonna be according to what you want in here it's 30 but uh, i just uh, put it to 30 uh, but if you want to put it to 75 then you can do that as well uh, and see how, how it looks like but uh, it doesn't look that much difference <laughs> yeah that, that's just how it is uh, because i have already 
do this padding like this and that's why it showed not that much of a different but yeah that's just everything there is the padding left you can ignore this there is already reserve calls uh reserve playlist calls here so you don't need to care about it that much um and then the next part that you need to do is uh go to that config file again uh, and cmpcpp and cmpcpp web result and then check check if the config is up to your standard by executing and cmpcpp web result here right let's say yeah i mean like this i guess i don't but yeah let's just say you like it and then after that yeah, you need to uh, you need to copy this well you can link it but i, I just copied it Co copy it to your padding right yeah, if you don't know how to add uh, padding into your uh, user directory you can search that in browser or something uh, if you still didn't find it then I'll leave a comment down below I'll, uh, yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll teach you how it's just a couple line of a couple line of thing and well just one line really one line in your Z profile I think but yeah just copy that into local bin for example copy and uh, copy ncmcpp web result into your dot uh, local bin yeah. upper right yeah. yeah you have to do that or uh, you can use ln hyphen s to link it i it doesn't work for me for some reason like uh, let's see rm ncmcpp web result ln hyphen s uh, and cmbcpp web result to dot local bin cmbcpp web result see it doesn't work for me for some reason so i just use the copy option and not the linking option but yeah that, that's all there is to it um, that's the end of the video uh, if you like it uh, share uh, if you like it then give a thumbs up uh, if you don't like it uh, leave a dislike that's fine as well share it with your video eh, share it with your friend if you if you enjoy the video and then uh, yeah that's it I'll see you in the next video see you